So, you're wearing your hat. Yes, I wanted you to know that I was a chaplain in the United States Navy for eight years. Wow, when was that? That was in the late 80s into the early 90s. Okay, and it took you where? Well, I served most of my duty at the Naval Hospital in Bethesda because we lived around the corner from it. Okay. And it was a good time experience. I had the privilege of ministering to uh, women and men in the Navy as well as in the Marine Corps. I would have worn a uniform today, however, that was 50 pounds ago, and I'm afraid I can't get into anything that I own except the hat. None of us know what that means. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> that brings us to our coming celebration on Sunday for the 4th of July. That's right. Looking forward to it. What's going to happen? Well, first, uh, we're going to have a sing-along. We'll get those good uh, grand old flag and this land is your land and others at 9.30, a patriotic sing-along. So come along early. David Neff, our music director extraordinaire, is going to lead us through those singing uh, times. So come and enjoy that time. And the 4th of July, uh, Monday, uh, Sunday, we'll be remembering how God has blessed our country. Uh, our foundations are in the Christian nation idea, and we still hope that God has an active role to play in what happens here in the United States. And certainly in our church, which has people from many different countries that have found a home here in this country that we call home, and in our church. And so that brings diversity to our congregation and what freedom means and what welcome and hospitality means and welcoming the stranger and that's one of the gospel readings this sunday i'm going to be talking about mm -hmm. it's a it's a challenging time i think in our civil discourse together yes it is and we hope that god blesses it as well so that we can be honest with one another and find leadership which takes us into the next few years and and speaking truth and love to one another and just being kind my goodness um, how far that goes. I saw a phrase that said, kindness is free. Uh, so wherever you are this weekend uh, traveling, we keep you in our prayers. If you're here, come sing with us and pray with us and worship with us and um, give thanks for our freedom. Indeed. That I can still do. The push-ups and all. <laughs> Bye. Safe work.